Hi everyone, today we're going to be going over a new type of problem. It's for sum of quantities, and I'm going to give an example word problem. So, sum of quantities word problems are basically when they give you what the sum of two of the quantities are, and they tell you that one is higher than the other, but it doesn't exactly tell you the um, numbers for each individual quantity. So, I got an example with football. The Georgia Bulldogs and the Florida Gators played a football game. As expected, the Bulldogs won by eight points. If the sum of the scores for both the Bulldogs and the Gators was 32, then what was the score for each team? Okay, so the best way to solve these kinds of problems are with an equation. But we only need one variable in this case because one thing is unknown. So, we can set f as our variable for the Florida Gators. We'll make that a better f. Okay. And the Bulldogs are equal to f, but you have to add 8. So, f plus 8 is equal to the Bulldogs. Okay. But, what we need to figure out is what each individual one is. So, if this is the Bulldogs and F is equal to Gators, to find the total, we just add these two quantities. So we can do F plus F plus 8 is equal to 32. Now this is a pretty simple equation. You just get 2f plus 8 is equal to 32. Now you subtract 8 from both sides of the equation. You get 2f is equal to 24. Now you divide both sides by 2. You get f is equal to 12. So, now we know that the Florida Gators have 12 points. Okay? But, we still don't know how many the Bulldogs have. Well, if it says the Bulldogs won by 8 points, that means they had 8 more points than the Gators did. So, it would just be 12 plus 8. 8, which is equal to 20. Therefore, the Georgia Bulldogs had 20 points, and the Gators had 12 points, and you can check this answer, because the sum of both of the, their scores was 32. 20 plus 12 is 32. So, yeah, that's how you solve a um, pretty simple word problem that may... Get some people stuck. Bye, everyone.